allow me fixing everything and because there is always something to be fixed if you have a problem like this one uh, yeah we'll just check something uh, I have the cable connected I will go to computer management which is uh, device manager same in the uh, Windows 7 by the way and uh, this is the one when you unplug it it's going to disappear it all the drivers are fine everything is perfect so when I plug it in I unplugged it and plugged it in you saw it was missing and now it's going to refresh it and it's going to appear so we will give properties and then we have a driver all installed 2.8.24 is the driver I'm running port settings advanced latency here could be the highest possible not that it matters that much but we got a COM port 3 latency timer set to 1 usually the machine is set up to COM port 1 but I have something else on COM port 1 I don't know what exactly it is some communication port or something so uh, yeah it uh, it's on COM port 3 so we need to change it and instead of uh, reinstalling the whole thing we'll click on uh, ADA ABAS then go to the bin folder then we're looking for OBD file OBD can you see OBD so here we open and change to COM1 and delete this one 3 then we're gonna save it and this file we will copy it and we will put it in the windows folder don't ask me why copy ctrl c i don't know but it, it it made a difference once so i'm doing it ever since windows where is the windows folder and don't don't forget that you slapped it here in case you need to re read or something okay so we are going to go 360 again maybe we need to uh, switch the thing into the car yeah well let's go to the car so after I change the com port to 3 in the bin folder all connected up ignition is on that's a BMW 60 uh, and uh, what is it m57 engine mismatch something and then we're gonna read the error codes that's what we need error codes we need to read read the error memory and we can see that it's uh, working it's all in german though <laughs> how are we gonna fix the language i don't know very interesting but yeah it works so i hope this video is uh mean helpful to you let's read uh i'm actually reading that i want to read the transmission so let's see read the error memory oh definitely need to fix the language <laughs> no problem I hope uh, this video has been helpful to you and I'll see you into the next one bye bye